Hey everybody, welcome back. Everyone seemed to really enjoy the video I did last week where I went to the wine store and picked out some high QPR wines that are available for around $20 or so in the United States. And so today I'm going back. And this time I'm going to include a few white wines as well as some more red wines. So stick around and I'll put on my mask and head right in. My first pick is the Trimbach Pinot Blanc. This is a delightful white wine from the Alsace region of France. You're going to have some crisp, refreshing acidity. This wine is going to pair well with a wide variety of foods. It's available for around $15, and you should be able to locate this one pretty much worldwide. So I definitely recommend this one. Paso Robles is another place for some good value, especially for those who are unable to find Cabernet from Napa at attractive pricing. And so one I highly recommend is the Dow Cabernet Sauvignon from Paso Robles. This is the 2018 bottling. It's available for about $22. Dow is an excellent up-and-coming producer and definitely one that I highly recommend. It's probably a little bit more robust than some of the Napa Cabernet, but I think you'll definitely enjoy it. And for those of you who find yourself in the Paso area, it's definitely worth a visit as well as they have incredible scenery there and outstanding views from the top of Dow Mountain. Napa Cabernet is unfortunately quite expensive these days and even at the entry levels it's difficult to find something that's below 40 or 50 dollars. However, for those looking for something around the 25 dollar price point, this BV Cabernet Sauvignon from Napa Valley would be an excellent choice. It's a little bit more than the 20 dollar price point but I think it still offers excellent value for the quality at that price. There's certainly lots of good value in Alsace and as I mentioned earlier the Trimbach wines are good options. Albrecht is another good choice. They have these Albrecht tradition wines for Pinot Gris, Pinot Blanc, for Riesling, for Gewürztraminer, and they're all about the same price, $18, $19 in the United States, probably less than that in Europe. And so that's going to be another reliable producer that you can count on to offer excellent value for some well-produced, high-quality wines at about the $20 price point. So there's certainly plenty of value in South America. In Argentina in particular, the Bodega Norton Malbec 2018 is definitely another one I recommend. This one's around $13.50 or so. One of my good friends who's a sommelier in New York used to have this on her by the glass list at her restaurant and it was always well received. So I definitely recommend this one as well. So as you can see, there's a number of excellent wines you can get for about the $20 price point. I would be more than happy to drink any of these wines and hope that you enjoy them as well. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss the next one. I come out with videos like this once a week. If you have any ideas for videos that you'd like to see, please go ahead and let me know in the comments below. And if I use the idea and make a video about it, I'll mention your name during the video. Until then, drink well.